Hi, this is the introduction for the uh, Wells Photoshop project. This would look like the final result that you would have. What you first have to do is open the Wells Beneath instructions. They'll tell you which pictures you need to gather and have ready before you can start with the instructions. So open it up, find the pictures that you need in Google Images or a similar place. You need a total of seven different things to put in, perhaps more. That will depend on what you want to do. But when you get finished, your picture will look similar to this. Or actually similar to this, the one that I made. You're going to notice that I made a few changes in the original picture and I've added shark, I've added a squid, I left a second whale, and I added a little bit of lightning in order to add a little bit of flare to this. There are 14 different layers, and each of the layers do a different thing. For example, if you look at the water, you can see that there's a little bit of cloud area. There are some particles that have been added. And, of course, each one of the animals that's been put in place, you're going to add by bringing it in and capturing it and bring it into another layer. I will show you how to do each of those, but to get started, go to File, to New, and you're going to want to have the following settings. A width, 750. This is pixels, not inches. A height of a thousand pixels. Click OK and you're in good shape. Now if you notice the little squares that are on there, the reason they were there is because when I went to File and New, I chose the content for the background to be transparent. If it's set at white or the background color, please change it to transparent before you get started and then simply click OK and that will give you a transparent surface to work on that is the right size to work with this photo. Thank you.